Hi everybody and welcome to episode 2 of Project Sapphire. I've put together this little series to document updates on uh, works being conducted to my 1954 Armstrong Sidley Sapphire 346. So follow along as we try and get it back on the road for its 70th birthday next year. Let's see how we go. Chuck us a subscribe. Cheers. All right, day two. On day two, next week, the following week, we're working on the Armstrong Sidley Sapphire 346, 1954. We've got the battery on the charger. Today, we'll be changing the points in the distributor. We've got some new points for that. And again, you can't see it, but we'll be putting in the uh, now reconditioned starter motor. Let's see what we can do. We've got a new belt as well, but hopefully we can leave that to the end because it's gonna be quite tr tricky trying to get that on without taking off the entire front grill and radiator. So let's see what we can do. Here's, here are the new points. You can see the little plastic foot is not snapped. We'll get those in. That's the old rotor cap because it looks like it's still in pretty good nick. There was another one. This one was in the boot. And that one's pretty... It'll work, but it could do with a bit of um, a bit of paper over it. It's the starter motor. He's put new bushes in the back there. And because that was sticking out, I don't know, like that, focus. And he's cleaned this up, put new shims in there. They were put in backwards. Um, and this, when it was pulling in, it was being pulled in too far and the bottom of this plate was rubbing against the, uh, the flywheel. That might have been why we were seeing shearing. That's all, that's a lot tighter than it was. Um, yeah, so we'll put that in now. All right, we've got the new starter motor in. That was a bit of a pain. I got on underneath it and put the bolts in underneath. And it sounds so, so, so much better. So we got compression, which is very nice. But it sounds so, so, so much better. Before that, it was... It was horrible. My mum made cupcakes for my sister's birthday, so I'm having a cupcake break. So we've got the old rotor, but we've cleaned it up with some uh, paper, emery paper, and we've got the new points on it. And we'll see how that goes. We've got spark, though, when we roll it over, turn it over, rather. We do have spark from one of the leads, so... It's doing something right. It's alive! Running very nice and clean too. We got amp charging. Clock doesn't work yet. We got fuel, temperatures climbing, oil pressure's coming up. Let's go for a drive and we're on half chuck. 